2K24 is finally here, man. First video 2K24 on the channel. Y'all already know, man. We getting straight to this build. But before we get into this build, I just want y'all real quick. I usually wait till the end of the video to say this, but I want y'all real quick right now to please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. If you're ready and excited for NBA 2K24 and looking forward to seeing more of it on our channel, all right? But let's get straight into it, man. Y'all already know what's going on, man. First video, first build that we are creating in 2K24. All right, my bad for that cut, man. I had to do my face scan real quick. But here we are, man. You see the options you get now when creating a build. You can create your own build from scratch or use the NBA template. I'm going to go ahead and play around with this because I don't know yet what approach I want to take with this build. I know for sure I'm making a shooting guard, but I don't know what approach I want to take in terms of play style, archetype, all that stuff. Y'all already know what it is because y'all see the title and the thumbnail. But yeah, I'm about to go ahead and play around with this and then you guys will see the finished product, all right? All right, y'all. So after playing around with the My Player Builder, this is my finished product for my first build. So as you can see, looking all the way to the left, it's a shooting guard at the height of 6'6", six, six, weighing 208 with a wingspan of 6'11". So I did use an NBA template. I used a template of Jalen Brown. Knowing that I wanted to create a shooting guard for my first build, I went ahead and looked at the NBA templates that they have for shooting guard builds. And for the approach that I was looking at in terms of having a, a two-way player, Jalen Brown's was the best from there. I played around with it and I alternated it. So like if you were to take that template and compare it to this setup, it's going to look completely different because I tweaked it up tremendously based on how I'm looking to play with this build and ultimately with this build I'm just looking to score and being able to defend the perimeter that is it and so you know given that I made sure that my driving was at a point where I can finish and get a good amount of silver tier s badges same thing goes for the shooting as well same thing goes for the ball handling and in this playmaking category you'll see that I left the passing accuracy at a 60 again because I'm not looking to really facilitate if I need to I will but that's not my priority that's not my focus so hopefully I won't have to so pass accuracy is at a 60 for this build and then from there following on to the defense you see the only thing that's really up on the defense is the perimeter defense standing there at an 85 to allow me to get at least silver clamps I got the steal on a 60 because I'm not really looking forward to using glove and then right stick I'm not really going to use a right stick to get steals and such so 60 was the threshold to be able to at least get bronze interceptor so that's that and then moving on to some of the physical attributes speed I wanted to get it enough to be able to get at least silver speed booster and hyperdrive and then acceleration was the same thing to get those silver tier s badges including speed booster and then strength was also a priority for me I wanted to get at least my strength up to 60 because it allows me to get fearless finisher up to silver you, that's one thing to keep in mind that some of these badges that might show up for uh for finishing or such and such they're tied into some of the other attributes so that's one thing to keep in mind when playing around with these attributes but that is it that is it so I'm gonna read through everything from the top to bottom just to give you guys one more final run through the close shot is on 77 driving layup on the 86 driving dunk on the 86 standing dunk on the 40 mirroring shot on the 86 three-point shot at an 87 free throw on the 74 pass accuracy on 60 ball handling on 88 speed with ball on 85 interior defense 38 perimeter defense 85 steal 60 then we jump from there to defensive rebound and put that out of 41 speed at an 81 acceleration at an 80 strength on 60 vertical at 75 and the stamina at 94 and again this is a shooting guard position at the height of 6'6 weighing 208 pounds with a wingspan of 6'11 I'm excited to see how this build turns out so let's see we get shades of Knicks Blazers and Rockets we got J.R. Smith Anthony Simons and Jalen Green we gonna call this one the Jalen Green build since he's the biggest name y'all comment down below who's the bigger name within this group J.R. Smith or Jalen Green I guess Jalen Green is the more relevant one but J.R. Smith bigger because he's accomplished more yeah yeah six man of the year chip with the Cavs we gonna give it to JL Smith all right but you see it right there I have built a shot creating three level threat that's exactly what we're looking for a shot creator you know giving a nod to Kobe you feel me this is the Kobe year 24 we about to go crazy all right but I'm gonna test the build I'm gonna do that on my own time before I go ahead and actually start on my career with this build but that is it for this build again we'll make more builds in the future but this is our first one this is what we're gonna go ahead and start off with y'all go ahead and comment down below as I get gameplay with this build I'll go ahead and share that all with you guys uh, throughout the channel and throughout our social media platforms definitely go ahead and follow us on that links down below um but y'all go ahead and comment down below let me know what builds you guys are interested in seeing you know any specific players you guys want to see builds that replicate them please comment that down below and i'll go ahead and cook that up for y'all but make sure y'all hit the like button and subscribe to the channel as that helps us out tremendously with the success of this channel and bringing better content to you all but that is it for this one all right i'm gonna holla at y'all on the next one y'all be easy until then make sure y'all turn on that post notification so i can catch y'all on the next one all right but i see y'all man until then love